Hi, today we are demonstrating app 3.0. I will log in. And it will take me to my list of bikes. I have four bikes on my account and I will choose the top bike. I will demonstrate how to, as you notice, it is uh, searching for the device. This is Bluetooth. This is only needed when you're trying to manage the alarm. I also like to wait until I have uh, the green light working as well. But we'll go ahead, it's connected, and we'll set the alarm. So we'll go ahead and press set alarm. We get feedback and the alarm is set. We'll press turn off alarm and we get the feedback and it's off. Sometimes they don't work on the first try, so it's okay to toggle back and forth until the red light is uh, on. The ultimate authority is the device. If it, the li red light is on, the alarm is on. Here's the fine bike feature, and it'll show the current location. And the last one is if you want accurate trips, I recommend using the stop trip button when you've completed a trip. And up here in this menu, you can um, change the bike photo. We're gonna choose the gallery and you can choose a, a picture, but we're gonna get out of that somehow. And you can change the bike name. So that's the new app. I hope uh, here's a couple more things. Your trips are down here, the bottom. Stats are up here in this corner. And then settings are over here to the right. And we can go ahead and change that to miles and auto start and go back to bike list. If your device doesn't auto, doesn't connect quickly to Bluetooth, it's appropriate to back out and, and, and back in again. Notice how my device fell asleep. So the device needs to be awake to connect. It's connected, and we can start over again. Thank you.